All right, today I'm gonna to teach you how to play crokinole in just three minutes. So if you're the first person taking the shot, you're trying to hit it within this middle circle for your first shot. Okay, after that, it would have been nice to hit it in the actual hole and get 20 points, but this circle's 15, this circle is 10, and this circle is five. If you land halfway in the middle at the end of the game, or at the end of a round, you'll actually score the lesser of the two points, so that would be only five points there. Now, the other person's turn, they're gonna fire from anywhere on this line, just like you did, the outer line, and they're going to try to hit yours. If they don't hit yours, like say they just kinda, of, oh, that actually did hit it, okay. So that was, no, that was a legal attack, right? Uh, and now, Say it comes to my turn, and I go right there. That's illegal. This gets taken off, and that's one less uh, puck that I'm going to score by the end of the game. Okay. You alternate. Keep on shooting back and forth. You have to hit your opponent's puck before you do anything. So... If I try to hit my own, that would not work. You gotta hit my opponent's puck for it to be legal. Okay. Um, I could try to hit my own, but then both of them would actually be taken off if I touched them both. But that was actually legal, and I made my points score a 10, and his points only score a 5. So my opponent, Blue, comes in here and is trying to hit me. Alright, that doesn't work. And then I go. I knock my opponent out and actually get the full 20. Now, whenever you make a 20, you actually keep this and then you store it for later. Okay? So for us, we just have this weight bench when we're playing and we just keep it right here to designate that that was 20 points. If they are in the gutter on your opponent's side, that's a zero points. They got knocked out. Just like this one just got knocked out. So we'll just keep on going back and forth, back and forth until the end of the game, and maybe the end of the game looks kind of like this. Okay, so here we would have some on the lines. Okay, that one, this one's on the line, we'd move it down, and then we'd score them all. So we'd have the 20 points, plus a 15, plus a, a bunch of 10s, and then plus a five, versus my opponents. You would take the difference, and that would be the score. So that's really how you play Crokinole.